So today we're going to be working on the Invacare MK6i drive blockout. I'm going to show you guys how to uh, disable that on the older Invacare chairs. Um, you need a programmer and actually the older kind that went on the action will also work as long as it has the uh, the bigger plug, XLR plug on it. You see here, there it is. Um, so what you want to do is um, you want to go through your menus and let's see, select the drive that you want to work on. And on this particular one, as you can see, it says drive three, and it says uh, drive lockout on it. So what that means is if you're tilted back on the chair, it will go into creep mode where it just barely moves. Um, so if you want to disable that, go ahead and plug the programmer in. Okay. We're going to press power on the programmer. Let me see if I can get enough light here. So here we are finally. So you want to go into advanced menu, press enter. You want to go down to power seating, press uh, enter select. Uh, we're in drive three, so go to drive three. Here, drive lockout, you see it says on. Click the select button. And you want to turn it to off. Press select. Then you want to go to save. Press save again. And then press power. After you press power, it will be turned off. Um, the draw like that is off. So um, you see this is a line through. Now, this is the older black and white one. They do make a color one. It works the same way. And you'd have to do that in every single drive. So this is actually the older programmer for the action chair, but I do have the double plug, so um, if you guys ever want to do any other, you can do that, or you can do stuff through the, um, the SD card too. So, uh, but if you have a programmer around and you don't want to fool with the SD card, then there you go.